Man, I am so bored, today is April 1st, and it's April Fool's Day, what should I do? I know, I will prank everyone on April Fool's Day, ha 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 First, I need to prank Talking Duke the first. Alright, I'm going to put the whoopee cushion underneath the couch cushion, and when he sits down, it will make a farting noise. This is going to be so funny. Okay, now I'm going to hide right next to the TV. Alright, now I'm going to watch some TV. What? What was that? Did I just fart? What is going on around here? Ha 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 April Fools. What? April Fools? Oh no! Please don't tell me that you are going to prank everyone on this holiday. Yes I am, because this is my favorite holiday, and you notice that there's a whoopee cushion underneath the couch? What? Hey, Talking Duke the Second, did you just prank me by putting the whoopee cushion underneath the couch cushion? Yes I did, and that's why you farted. Hey, I don't fart, I don't think it's very funny, I was enjoying watching some TV and then you pranked me like that. Oh too bad, so sad, I am going to prank some more people, so... Goodbye! Alright, now that I have pranked Talking Duke the first, who should I prank next? I know, I will prank Talking Tom by giving him a present and then I will prank all of my friends. Oh, and after that, I will prank call 911. This is going to be the funniest thing that I will ever do. They should call me Talking Duke the Second the Prankster. Ha 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 
How are we ever going to get with you burping and me hiccuping? I don't know, but we are going to find out who prank us. After when talking Duke the second pranks Hank along with the other friends. Now let's see what he calls 911. Hello! 911. Yes! It's me, Talking Duke the second. Talking Duke the first was robbing the bank. What? He robbed the bank. Oh my god! I will be here to stop the robber. Okay, thank you so much. Goodbye! Okay, I came as soon as you called, so what's going on? Yes! My friend Talking Duke the first was robbing the bank, and I want you to stop that robber. Um. I don't think Talking Duke the First is robbing the bank, he would never do such a thing, and are you trying to trick me? Um, yes I did, I prank called 911. Oh, my, God, Talking Duke the Second, how dare you prank call 911, you know that's a criminal offense, and also you know that calling 911 to know when there is a real emergency, not to prank call. Oh, and speaking of that, your friends will come along and have a bunch of words with you. Talking Duke the second, I heard you were prank calling 911 to make it look like I robbed the bank. No, I didn't rob any banks at all, and also, I can't believe you pranked me by putting a whoopee cushion underneath the couch to make it look like I farted, how embarrassing of you. Yeah, and you pranked me by giving me the gift with a jumpy thing inside, you know that I wanted was my phone, not this ridiculous jumpy thing, you should have given me a present that has a phone in it instead of this jumpy thing. And you pranked me by replacing wine with this expired milk inside the bottle. Do you know how long the milk was in there for? And do you know how sick I was? You should be ashamed of yourself. And you also pranked me by playing the loudest music ever. And do you know how loud it was to cause my whole house to shake? And now my ears are bleeding because of you. And did you know how you scared everyone in the whole world because of this loudest music? Not only that, you pranked me by putting burp powder in the juice. You should know that I only drink juice with no powder in it. And you also pranked me by putting hiccup powder in my tea to make it look like I am hiccuping. You know that hiccups always happens when a diaphragm pushes the lungs into my voice box, not from tea. Yes! And finally, you pranked me by setting up a contraption around my house to make it look like I was flying in the whole room. This is, has got to be the worst thing you have ever done to me. Now I have to go to the hospital after all of this. You will no longer to become the prankster, and you should be ashamed of yourself for pranking us. Yes! And also talking Duke the second, for pranking all of your friends, including 911. I'm going to have to arrest you for this. Now turn around and put your hands behind your back. But officer, I like to prank people on April Fools, because this is my favorite holiday. I am so sorry. No! Your sorry won't do anything. Your pranks to people will be no more. When we get to the police station, you will have to go to jail in your prison outfit. Because you can't go to prison without your outfit. Come with me to the police car. You are going way downtown. This is your jail cell, and you will stay here for 20 years. So, goodbye! Talking Duke the second, that was the most worst thing you have ever done to everyone, including me. Did you know how Hank was badly injured because of your contraption? Now he has been rushed to the hospital because of you. And did you know how upsetting it was for Ginger for playing the loudest music? Why would you have to prank everyone on April Fool's Day like that? Because Talking Duke the first, this is my favorite holiday to prank all of my friends, especially you, and this is why they called me Talking Duke the second the prankster. I am really sorry, and can you please bail me out of jail, and I promise I won't prank everyone ever again. No! Your apologies and forgiveness are not going to work from you ever again, and I am not bailing you out of jail. And now look at you, now you're in your prisoner outfit. Your friends should be ashamed of you for pranking everyone, and prank calling 911 was a criminal offense, and you will no longer to prank everyone on this holiday, that is really it. You are so 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 grounded 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 until you will need to learn your lesson not to prank everyone again. When you get out of jail, you will have to write apology letters to Tom, Ben, Ginger, Hank, Angela, and Becca, including myself, and it has to be in honorable words, not mean words. 
I am leaving right now, I will see you whenever I see you. Goodbye. Oh man, I can't believe I did that to all of my friends especially talking Duke the first. I wish my pranks will keep on going, but now my pranks are coming to an end, and this was the worst idea after all. Now I will have to write apology letters to all of my friends when I get out of jail. Can my life get any way, 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 way worse than this? Wow.